Now more than ever, guys, you have to be careful of who's in your ear because you'll give them access to your heart. And we'll talk more about that right after this. Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Live Well with Coach B. And of course, yes, I'm Coach B. And today, we're not talking about physical food. We're talking about spiritual food this time around. And when I'm talking about spiritual food, I'm not just talking about the things of God, but I'm talking about words. I'm talking about the things that you're hearing because words are spirit. You don't see them, but they do have an impact on your health, whether physically good or physically bad, or mentally good or mentally bad. So that's what we're focusing on today because who's in your ear determines what you will love into your heart. You know what I found very interesting, guys, is that the word ear is also found in the word heart. So who's in your ear? What are they talking to you about? Because that impacts the way you think, the way you see yourself, the things you do. And here's the reality, guys. The Word of God gives us tons of spiritual mental help where needed. I don't know why people don't look into it. But Psalm chapter 1, verse 1 from the Amplified Version tells us this. Blessed, fortunate, prosperous, and favored by God is the man who does not walk in the counsel of the wicked, following their advice and example. And you may be wondering, you know, why is my life going in this trajectory? Why are things going here? Why are things not coming together? Why, 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 why? Look at who you've been listening to. Look at what conversations you've been getting yourself into. And also look at the stuff you have not been getting into. Have you not been getting into the word of God? Have you not been seeking godly counsel? Who's in your ear? What's interesting, you know, they say insanity is doing the same thing over and over again, hoping for a different result. So if you're listening to the same people over and over again, guys, what do you think that happened? What do you think is going to happen? You already know. You're going to end up in the same situation and the same things are going to be happening over and over again because you're basically in a cycle, listening to the same set of people, getting the same set of advice, and you're getting nowhere fast. So change who's in your ear because it affects your heart. Start doing some introspection. Who are you giving your ear to? Because guess what? You're going to start pondering on these things. Let's be honest. The more you hear something, that's why music is so powerful. The more you hear it, you don't even gotta look up your words. It's in your subconscious and from the moment that song starts playing, you're gonna start singing that song. You're gonna start tapping your foot because it's resonating with you. So be very, very careful guys. Now more than ever, who's in your ear because you'll give them access to your heart. All right guys, so hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, give me a thumbs up. If you're new here, welcome aboard. Click that subscribe and like button guys. And if you guys wanna see more videos like this, let me know in the comment section below because health is holistic. It's not just what you're eating, but also what's eating you. All right guys, bye.